have a number of samples that we need to process. So it's going to be a busy evening. Steve was talking earlier about a few of the processes that they're going to be working through, so it's going to be exciting. Yeah, I'm excited. It's always fun to, to see the animals on deck and compare it to what you saw uh, in the water. Uh, they sometimes look a little bit different than what you expect, and, and they tend to be a different size than uh, what you might expect. You know, you have a sense of how big these things are using the lasers, but sometimes things that are, are large look kind of small, and sometimes things that you think are big are actually much smaller than you anticipated. Well, there was one of the sea cucumber cucumbers, right, that looked like you could just, like, cradle it like a baby, like yeah. it was a good, <laughs> good chunker. We'll see. We have collected some of those large types of sea cucumbers before. Um, you often see them on the abyssal plains, actually. Uh, these like very large, small child-sized cucumbers. My favorite one uh, is one that we've been calling the gummy squirrel. It's a species of Cypropodes. It has a very long um, tail that looks ah. a little bit like a squirrel's tail, and it's bright yellow. It just looks like the same consistency and texture as a gummy bear. Are they too mostly consisting of water, much like the sea cucumber? Exactly. So they're a type of sea cucumber, and um, they have a hydrostatic skeleton, which means they use water to give them their three-dimensional form. So if you were to cut into this animal, all that water would just gush out, and they really don't have that much tissue and structure other than that water that's keeping them in their shape. You were saying earlier, it's kind of like a big water balloon. Yeah, exactly. We are nearing the surface. We'll probably wrap up here and let the front row do their thing. This has been the first dive of the Lu'ua'ai Hiki Ke Kualono Kai Expedition. We're diving on unnamed seamount C. Seeing what we could find. It's been a wonderful 24 yeah, hours. Yeah, doing that. Oh, yeah, and then... Whoop. Oh, yeah. We're going to be right on time. Watching you, Argus. Hmm? Watching. Waiting for the eye contact. Watching. I wait for her to talk. Uh oh, we're early. Five zero meters, I'll stop. Deck control. We're at five zero meters, full stop. Are you ready to recover? Control van is ready Do to recover. It. <laughs> what? Changing things up. Yeah. Do it. See how fast they go. Full speed. Oh, this is good. This is right to the bridge's watch change, too. Yeah. That's ideal. Everybody will be there. What are you looking at? Sorry, I can't hear. Computer? Herc GUI. What are doing? Maybe Herc, I don't know. Do they just want their graphonographs, Aaron? They can't get that anywhere.
darkness falls. Bridge nav, can we reduce stress on the jet pump? Is there ever any doubt? Is it what? Was there ever any doubt? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. Trevor, Trevor. So much self-doubt. <laughs> I thought we talked about this. <laughs> I hope whoever's on deck is familiar with the new ground straps. Uh, why? Uh, What's different? They're a twist lock instead of a clamp. Oh, tricky. Yeah. You don't need to use the high voltage gloves to grab them. Mm. Yeah, free scoop them, but they're not going to be intuitive if you don't know already. Any no good socks. How disappointing. <laughs> Got to have your recovery socks, man. Bridge nav, you can increase stress on the jet pump and hold position. Uh. That's not what I want.
deck lights, eh? Okay. That heave. Yeah. Heave and roll. Perfect. Hmm? Oh, I'll remember. Yeah, we're full on the old reservoir. 25 PSI. 22 and a half, anyway. Rock solid. Huh. I see those little fishies. Oh, cool. That looks very tropical. Cute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Aquarium shot. <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> So entertaining. Trying to eat Herc. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh no. Yeah. I think it's their mama. So yeah. You're yellow too. <laughs> Turn on the slurp. Steve's taking a photo of us. Everybody smile. Push forward. 